Hey guys, welcome back to Steam Stacks. My name is Mitchell, and today we're going to be going over what DSR technology is, or Dynamic Super Resolution. And as you can see, it's a technology by NVIDIA that you can have 4K quality footage or video on any like any 1080p screen that you have. So you can have a 4K monitor without actually buying a 4K monitor. And I have tried it, and I'm going to tell you right now that it, that it does work. I have never seen a 4K screen, and when I turned this on and I played the Elder Scrolls Online, it's kind of like putting on a new prescription of glasses. If you have, if you wear glasses or anything, if you upgrade prescription or something like that, you know that's kind of like the 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 feeling that you get in your eyes the first time you turn it on. If you have never seen a 4K screen before, and that's definitely the feeling that I got when I turned it on. But I'm going to be showing you how to enable it on your computer. What you do have to have, though, is number one, you have to have an NVIDIA graphics card. And I'll leave the I'll leave a link in the description on this on this page on the supported graphics cards, but you know it, there's a pretty wide variety of graphics cards that you can use. A couple pages here. So if you have any of these graphics cards, you're good to go. You can use this, and it really doesn't take away performance when you're when you're gaming or anything like that. It maybe takes away five to ten frames per second, was what I've noticed, but it is well worth it. You know, because I, I I've been playing uh, Elder Scrolls Online. At about 60 frames a second on ultra settings, like I have a tank computer. But when I turned this on, you know, maybe I was getting about 50 and I was spiking at 45. But there's really no difference. I can't tell the difference between 45 FPS and 60 FPS. I don't know if you can either, but it is definitely worth turning on and maybe checking out if you've never seen a 4K screen before or if you would like one and you don't want to spend like $500. But uh, I'm going to show you how to turn it on. So if you're all good to go and you have, you have this one of these cards on these lists. All you have to do is you gotta search the NVIDIA control panel on your on your computer here. And this is gonna bring up this screen right here. And what you wanna go and go do is you're gonna go to manage 3D settings and it'll take you to this screen. And you'll see DSR factors here. And most likely if you have never heard of this, this is gonna be off for you. All of these are gonna be uncheck marked and it's gonna be like normal. What you wanna do is obviously you want to turn it on four times or you can even turn it on two times to double your resolution but I have it on four times because it's you know four times 1080p is what it is four times the native resolution because I want to do the best of the best so you turn it on and you also get an option here DSR smoothness I'm pretty much this is just how smooth the edges are what you, what you can kind of think of D DSR is kind of like Nvidia's like version of anti-aliasing maybe it just it really makes the image sharper and it moves removes all the the jaggies. I, I believe there's like some sort of like pictures of grass and Dark Souls that you can check out before and after DSR that Nvidia released a while ago. But it 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 does work. It does work. But so all you have to do is turn that on. And I think there is a button that like that that appears down here that says apply or something. You want to make sure you hit that. I'll, I'll go ahead and turn it on and off for you just to so just see. Actually, you know, I don't want to do that because I'm worried that's going to screw up the capture. But it should say, like, apply or something. You'll want to hit that, and your, your monitor is going to refresh. Okay, once you have it enabled in your NVIDIA control panel, all you need to do is go to the settings of your game, and you'll see an option for 4K resolution. Go ahead and click that, and you can see the magic happen. And I don't know if you guys can see this. I don't know if Shadow Play picks it up on the capture or not, but this is a lot better than it was at 1080p. A lot sharper, a lot more smooth. There's, I can't even see any jaggies or whatever you call them. I, I call them jaggies. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. Um, leave a comment below what you think of this technology, and I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.